with that, we have Ashley Sands out of ECU attempting a forward one and a half somersault pike. The dive from Ashley. Quick, not the best on the toss. Here we go with Lauren Burrell from U of H. Attempting a backward dive tuck. Wasn't exactly what they were looking for. The judges, that is. And Abernathy coming up from U of H as well. That's a very graceful walk up. And we have Patricia Roscoe of the University of Connecticut attempting a forward two and a half somersault pipe. And similar result there from Patricia as we just saw from Abernathy. 40, 25.2 low in total. Boucher coming up here from ECU. She is attempting a forward two and a half somersault tuck. And we're seeing that again. I mean, very similar dives to start. University of Houston, inward one and a half somersault pike. That was a much smoother entry there from last night. And good average scores for her first dive of the evening. Ellen Polish from the University of Connecticut attempting an inward two and a half somersault pike. Cincinnati. Wow, and a good dive from Ellen Koch. Maybe it was that entry. We'll get a better look on it. And now we have Brooke Posh Pishal from SMU with a back dive pipe. It was the pike straight down. And that was a good dive from Brooke. Getting some whistles from our head coach. And there you see it. Brooke, the eighth diver, obviously. And starting round two, we have Ashley Sams from ECU. She's attempting an arm stand forward, one somersault pike. And that arm stand didn't look like she looked like she kind of fell into the arm stand. We now have Lauren Burrell of the University of Houston attempting an inward one and a half somersault tuck. That's from the five meter. Four and a half across. Four and a half across the board. Total score. We now have her teammate, Caitlin Abernathy, attempting an inward two and a half somersault tuck. It's off the 7.5 meter platform. Looked like good entry there for Caitlin. Yeah, good scores for Caitlin from the gym. And we have Patricia Roscoe of the University of Cincinnati. That was an inward one and a half somersault top. Yeah, a good score from the judges. We have Alicia Ruche of East Carolina University, ECU, attempting a back dive pipe. Brooke earlier, quick pipe. Good entry, smooth entry. That pipe, good scores for Alicia. Now we have Michaela Butera of the University of Houston. Seven's across for Michaela Bowder. We now have Ellen Posh of Cincinnati. She's attempting an arm stand forward. And very balanced off the start. That entry came in a little bit too quick. We now have Brooke Posh Pishal of SMU. She is attempting a reverse dive pipe. Entries. Brooke died from what she did in the first round, but great score for Brooke. We now have Ashley Sams on round three of ECU. She's attempting a reverse dive tuck. Now it's off the five meter platform, but it's the scores from the judges. We now have Lauren Burrell of University of Houston. Better entry there from Lauren. Or compared to our first two dives. We now have Caitlin Abernathy of the University of Houston attempting a reverse one and a half somersault tuck. Good dive from Got a couple points off for her, but good dive for the silver medal. We now have Patricia Roscoe of Cincinnati. She's attempting an arm stand forward somersault pike. From the 10 meter platform. 
good balance. Blue loud on the splash. But it could result in good scores for the judges. Now we have Alicia Ruche of ECU. She is attempting an inward one and a half somersault tuck. Looks like she might have lost slight control there. About three quarters down on the dive. Good entry though. Kayla Batter from U of H. That looks like her best dive of the evening so far. Ellen Poach of Cincinnati. She is attempting a forward two and a half somersault pike. We now have Brooke Poshpashal from SMU attempting a forward two and a half somersault pike. Excuse me, the five meter platform for Brooke. We're back to Ashley Sands for round four. She's attempting an inward dive pike. Oh, this is Lauren Burrell from the University of Houston. At the back. One and a half somersault, half twist. We now have Caitlin Abernathy of the University of Houston. And that was a back one and a half somersault, one and a half twist. Looked a little bit early, slightly early on the entry. We now have Patricia Roscoe of Cincinnati. She's attempting a back one and a half somersault pike. Pretty smooth entry there from Patricia. We have Alicia Rouche now from ECU attempting an arm stand forward one somersault punt. The difficulty was just a 1.7 on that dive, but still. Michaela Buter, University of Houston, attempting a back dive pipe. Very quick off the pike and a great alignment. Ellen Poch, Cincinnati, attempting a back one and a half somersault pike. Very tight on the pike. Good effort scores. So Posh Pichel, SMU, inward two and a half somersault tuck. 7.5 meter platform. Very quick on the tucks. You can hear Tim Stilson, the head coach for diving. Your teammate from the men's side, Bryce Klein, also cheering her on. We now have Ashley Sams finishing up with the last round. Back one and a half somersault, half twist. Good scores for Ashley on her last dive of the evening. Lauren Burrell, University of Houston. Lauren, not too tight on the pike, but I think there's a little better entry for her. Lauren's been pretty consistent with her scores in the last three rounds. Let's see right there, her entries are getting better and better. But this was the last round. Caitlin Abernathy, her teammate. Very smooth entry. Like her cap almost came off on the dive. Maybe it wasn't the best start off the arms. Patricia Roscoe of Cincinnati. Very quick off the twist, a little late into the entry.
Houston, reverse dive pike. Get on the pike, another smooth entry from Michaela. Good scores. Those are up to 213 for the evening. We have Ellen Poche of the University of Cincinnati attempting a back one and a half somersault, one and a half twist. Quick on those five, on those twists again was Ellen Poche, but the entry. to the final dive of the night, Brooke Poshpashal, SMU, back one and a half somersault, one and a half twist. Good dive here and she will win gold. And that was definitely good enough by not only the dive but the reaction from her teammates and a good dive from Brooke will secure the gold medal for her and SMU. The women's platform diving. Followed by Michaela Bowder with from Houston. It's a total score of 213. And her teammate, Michaela, Caitlin Abernathy, excuse me, with a total score of 202.80. Great, great job by the women on the platform diving there. Special, the winner of the women's platform diving. Congratulations, those were amazing. What was going through your head throughout this? Um, I kind of just like, you know your dives and execute them like I always do. And I was, I was pretty calm, so I was like, still like prelims and I did, so I was happy. Absolutely, well you did a great job. Congratulations again. Back to you, A.B.